Okay. Hello, Ivan, and potentially Ivan team. All right, so if I'm understanding you correctly, you're using an AdWords to drive traffic to this landing page, and your account keeps getting suspended. So the the landing page is online because I'm looking at it, so that's that's not really the problem. problem is that uh, your AdWords account is... Uh, is not doing what you want it to do. So I'm going to show you a few different things that I think it, it possibly might be. Um, AdWords does have a lot of, uh, of requirements in terms of what you're supposed to be doing when you advertise. So you get, I think it's 125 characters. These characters are supposed to describe exactly what you find on the page. Now what I've done is I've taken the main call to action off the page itself, providing funding for commercial commercials investors with property for holding. I googled that and then I come up with all these people. Okay, so these people have, at some point in their AdWords account, they've targeted this exact term. These are their calls to action, all of which have been approved. So you have a, you have a couple of different choices in my mind. One, if you want to take the easy route, you can actually just copy some of this verbiage, okay, and then direct it to your landing page. There's a couple things that are wrong with your landing page. If that doesn't work, I can I can... Uh, run through these with you, but essentially it has to be paint by numbers in, in terms of what you're finding on the on the actual landing page itself. A good example would be to go to some of these other landing pages, and you have a f get a free information kit. So it's fill in your information, get your free information. Okay, that's it. Bang. Call to action is simple. If you go down, you know there's not that much other information on here. End of discussion. So theoretically, you're going to get an investor kit. Convenient and easy contact us today, setting up an appointment with one of our team. It's a little bit vague in terms of what you're supposed to do, uh, getting a free consultation, so on and so forth. Um, uh, let's see here. There might be some other things that are going on, but the fastest and easiest way, if these quick fixes don't work, is to actually... Um, call Google. They will put you on the phone with a Google AdWords rep who will tell you for sure why your ads are being uh, rejected. If for some reason you don't want to do that as a favor, I can do it. Um, you'd have to give me access to your AdWords account though. And then I can go in and basically look at the advertisements that you've been placing and figure out why your, your AdWords account is getting closed down. One last thing for you here. If you are going to run an AdWords account, there's a whole bunch of uh, great tools out there to help you. Um, essentially uh, come up with ad uh, verbiage and things like that really super fast. This is a cheat that I use all the time. Uh, most of these tools are free. SEM Rush is certainly one of them. So you just put in, you find a competitor, somebody that's doing exactly what your your guy is doing. Okay, you enter them in here and then you just sim simply do click on advertising research. Uh, you see where it says positions and position changes, competitors. What I like to look at a lot is ad text. So now I'm only going to get 10 examples, but you really don't need that much. So now I get the, the header of their ad, and then I get the body of the ad as well. And if you, if you go through these, this will give you a lot of really good examples of what people are using in your industry specifically for this kind of landing page. So you can start to dial in on what Google considers to be clear and concise language. My team, my project managers, run into account issues all the time. You just kind of have to experiment with it until you, until you find something that uh, is acceptable. Anyway, hope you found this helpful. Let me know if you didn't. I can certainly uh, just get in there, roll up my sleeves, and, and fix the problem for you. No doubt about it. All right. Thanks. Bye.